Hello, folks. This disturbing tweet is a little disconcerting. President Joe Biden says that Donald Trump brags about overturning Roe versus Wade and that he'll implement a national abortion ban. If you reelect me and Kamala, never mind the poor English there, if you reelect Kamala and I, and we take back the House and gain a bigger majority in the Senate, we will restore Roe versus Wade. No, you won't. And neither will Donald Trump. You see, the abomination, the whole cloth fabrication of law with Roe versus Wade in violation of the 10th Amendment over five decades ago was finally overturned by the Dobbs decision. And neither Donald Trump or Joe Biden has the legal authority to relegate or regulate abortion. It is not a federal concern. The 10th Amendment clearly makes this the case. The power is not delegated to the United States by the Constitution. There is no mention of abortion in the Constitution, nor prohibited by it to the states. The Constitution does not prohibit that to the states, are reserved to the states respectively or to the people. This tweet, which is viewed by tens of millions of people and retweeted and liked by many people who simply do not know the Constitution and enjoy fear-mongering. Donald Trump does not have the authority in any way whatsoever. Number one, he's not the legislature. He can't pass a law. And even if the legislature passes a law and he signs a bill into law, that law will be negated by the Dobbs decision because the federal government has no authority in this realm. That's the truth of the matter. And that's what's so shocking here. Joe Biden doesn't have the authority to do it either. He can't, neither one of them can issue an executive order which would make abortion illegal or legal. It's simply beyond their purview. Three separate and co-equal branches of the federal government, the judiciary, Supreme Court, the legislature, Congress, and the chief executive, the president. Neither Trump nor Biden have the authority to approve or disapprove abortion. This is an issue that rightly resides in the states. And this is fear-mongering from the Democratic Party and from the sitting president. And it'll work because a lot of people simply do not know how this republic works. What a sad day. What a sad day indeed. Donald Trump will not ban abortion. He has no authority through executive order. And any bill that comes before him that does that from the federal government will be null and void by the Supreme Court. Joe Biden cannot restore abortion. Roe versus Wade has been settled. It was unconstitutional. And the Dobbs decision has made that clear. Thank you, folks.